Marty Man here with uh, Earshot. Just want to start out by saying a uh, big fan of you guys. Been listening to y'all since I was like a kid. I'm in my mid-20s now. <laughs> but uh, nice. been listening to y'all for a minute now. Um, and uh, yeah, man, how's the tour been so far? How's it been touring with the other bands? Oh, this is my first time hearing about any of those guys as well. So, um, but yeah, how's it been so far? It's been good. It's, uh, it's uh, ups and downs. You know, it's the first time out in 10 years. Yeah. Uh, so, you know, we're just trying to get our legs back underneath us and opening bands have been great really solid guys great bands yeah and, um, all been having a good time so far yeah yeah I saw well, I went there for a second it looked like some like Static X type looking uh, stuff so I mean yeah yeah I mean I was like they look really sick so I'll have to I'll check them out after this sure. but um uh, like you said, I mean, you guys just got back into touring uh, after a while. Um, I know y'all put out, what, two albums, I think, like, years ago? Um, three, three, three albums, okay. Three albums and an EP, and now we just, uh, we just got back from Florida recording our fourth. We'll That's what I was going to ask. Yeah. Yeah, so... Um, you know, did you guys kind of like talk and decide to get back, you know, going and doing more like shows and stuff like that? Or how, how, how did you guys kind of like get the engine back running, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, it started with Las Vegas. Uh, it kept bugging me to do a show and just kind of organically all came together to do one show. And then yeah. Three or four shows. And, and uh, you know, a lot of different moving pieces until we finally arrived at this current level. Yeah. Hell yeah. We're, we're gonna do a bunch of stuff. And, 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 yeah. Well, I was watching a couple of live videos from this current tour, and I mean, you guys, you know, look sick as fuck. So I was stoked to see you guys. I drove like an hour and a half away. Right. Um, and uh, okay, you know, just getting straight into it. Uh, how'd the band form? Um, did, you know, was it a bunch of homies and stuff that you knew? Uh, how, how'd you guys form it? How'd you come up with the name as well? Uh, I came up with the name in a rush, actually. We were uh, our very first show, the promoter called, and we didn't have a name yet. And they called me and they said, we, we need a name to put in to advertise the show. What's it going to be? And I had a thesaurus of a dictionary because I was writing lyrics. And I just thought I wanted it to do something with sound. Yeah. And I flipped the sound and, and there was your shot. So I just said, your shot, keeping in mind that, you know, we could change it later. And it just kind of stuck. Yeah. No, that's a sick as, name. As far as the, how the band formed it, it's really gone through a lot of incarnations, even from the beginning. Like it, the, the band, everything happened so fast before we got a record deal that we didn't really have time to have the usual growing pains that a band has. So yeah. It's kind of, that's why it's evolved, um, you know, s somewhat over the years. But I feel really good about this current lineup. The record that we just made is... It's fantastic. I think it's our best record. It will be our best record. Oh, yeah. Well, I was listening to you guys uh, all the, the whole way over here, dude, and it was just, like, bringing me back to my childhood the whole time, dude. And I was like, bro, because like, I never got to see you guys live um, when I was younger. So I was like, this is – I don't know if they'll ever come through here again. And I was telling a couple of my friends that came, and I was like, bro, like, this band is badass live. Like, all I've done is watch videos of you guys, like, coming up to this. And uh, I don't know. I'm just a big fan. Um but uh, going into the new music, um, is it is it kind of <clears throat> the same style as, as the first couple albums? Uh, um, you know, you guys can answer to you. You guys are part of the band if you want to. But uh, is, it, is it the same style, uh, same type of music, you know? Uh, yeah, for sure. I mean, so Will, you know, Will was on all the records, obviously. And then this, with this on Incarnation, we're, like, writing together. And yeah. Will and yeah. lyrics and all that. For so sure. Like, that's the common thread, but we're like making new music together that incorporates what I do, what John does, but still keeps it yeah. true to the brand. It helps to bring new people in for sure. I've heard, you know, yeah. it, through other interviews and just talking to people. Um, it's just good to have fresh brains, you know, new ideas. Even yeah. if you're, you're, you're keeping to your roots and, you know, stay in the same type of band and stuff, it's good to have just new heads in it and uh, people that you can bounce ideas off of and, you know, hear, you know, feedback and hear their ideas and stuff. So, you know, it's always cool to, to have newer people in it because it's like not necessarily, you know, it's not a new band, but it's it's newer people that you can, you know, I don't know, it's like new relationships and stuff, and it's cool to just talk to people and, you know, hear their opinions on stuff, and 
I don't know, whenever you're like into music and shit, it's just the funnest thing to just jam and, and hang out and stuff. So, yeah. Um, so, uh, you know, another thing, uh, you guys were big. I think you guys were on like a couple of video games, weren't you? Yeah, yeah. Uh, how did uh, how did that happen, if you don't mind me asking? That's another thing just from my childhood I want to ask. I'm not really quite sure. I just got the phone call asking if we were okay with, you know, these songs being included in the video games. Yeah. It was Madden 2005. Yep. And I think that was the, uh, the main title. Yeah, I think there was like one more game that wasn't there or, or something. Was, uh, I think it was MX versus ATV. ATV. Yeah. And then, uh, and then of course, we had the Headstrong and Queen of the Day. Yep. Um, and it's out on other stuff. I think Legends of Wrestling is another one that it's out on. We just kind of, uh, we just kind of get these, these uh, notices that, hey, we'd like to use the song. It, yeah. Uh, which I'm sure is sick too. I mean, anybody would like to, you know, it's like a big ass franchise. You know, it's probably sick to be like, oh, I want to, I want to use your music. You know I'm what I'm a saying? Big Madden fan. Yeah. So, <laughs> I, I remember thinking like, why are you, why did you call me to ask? Yeah, so, exactly. But um, but no, that's that's typically how it goes. We just get the call, and you know, luckily people think of us to, to include us on those types of things. Oh yeah. So, um, you know, you guys are on a tour right now. I'll, I'll, I'll try to, I won't keep you guys too much longer. Uh, you guys are on a tour right now. Uh, what's the plan after the tour? Um, I know you said, you know, you got a new album coming out. Um, are you guys, you know, do you plan on taking a little break and, you know, pushing the album a little bit? Or do you want to tour right when that comes out? Or, or what, what's the plan right when that drops? So when we get back, we have to finish recording it. We okay. Have, um, we recorded all the drums. We've recorded all the main rhythm guitars. We have stuff bass to do I think is guitar leads and some vocals and then we, of course we've got to mix it master it come up with artwork decide if we're going to put it out independently or see if there's a label out there that you know that we feel like would be a good fit for us um, also next year is the 20th anniversary of our second album too yeah so we're contemplating going out and doing a a run for that as well as doing a separate run for a new album oh yeah so a lot of stuff we're just trying to see where the dust settles you know we wanted to come out and do this tour just to kind of like i said kind of get our legs back underneath yeah us again and, and uh, start in venues like this that are small and for there, sure and really you know reconnect with fans a hundred percent and you know like i said i talked to people inside when i first got here that I've been listening to you guys for a minute, talk to, you know, some friends of mine that I, that I brought that, you know, haven't listened to you guys at time, but are excited to listen to you guys. So yeah. it's bringing all different types of people out. Um, you're gaining new fans, old fans are going to see you again. So, you know, it's sick. And, uh, you know, you guys are doing the damn thing again. So it's, that's fucking awesome. Just, just as is, you know, you're touring and shit. So I'm stoked for it. And, uh, I always like to ask this to end off. Um, is there a band that you think deserves more recognition, not necessarily from your area, just in general, that you kind of listen to that you're like, fuck, dude, these bands, you know, these guys are slept on? Um, you know, I always felt like the band Quicksand Okay. more notice than they did. Okay. They're awesome. Bands. Yeah. Um, for me, I'd say the band Failure. Okay. Yeah. You got over that long, yeah. Yeah, for sure, dude. I don't know if I particularly have one on the top of my head, but there's a ton of bands out there that all have great talent. Yeah. Or work fine, that's for sure. I agree. I agree. Well, uh, you heard it from a man. Go check out those bands. Uh, they're super nice dudes. They let me interview them. Uh, go see them on tour if you get a chance, even if even if you got to drive a little bit, bro. Everybody's so scared to drive nowadays, and if it's well, like... You know what? driving yeah exactly they're dude ahead. they're having to drive more than anybody you know what i mean so Bounce come on <laughs> <laughs> well uh go out and see them live dude they're super nice guys i'm sure they'll chat with you buy some merch uh and yeah man i appreciate you guys so much for chatting with me uh y'all are fucking awesome so stoked to see you guys finally and yeah man thank you guys so much thank you again you're the best man thank you guys